damage to your favorite fashion. Save your winter wardrobe with these brilliant hacks. Please welcome stylist Christian Dare. Hello, how hello, you? good, hey. how are you? Great to have you with us in the studio and thank you for saving our fashion. I'm gonna try. Just gonna try. try. <laughs> yes, we can use the support. Yes. So one of the things with winter weather, it really does a damage on your fashion, on your hair, on your skin, lots of things, right? So mm -hmm. there's a few quick hacks you can do. The first one is humidity. Oh, so important. So I know we talk about humidifiers are great for your skin. Mm -hmm. They're actually really good for your clothes. Oh. Because you think about it, keeping your leather at a, like a prime temperature in your house, it's yeah. not going to dry, it's not going to crack out. That's true. It also cuts down on the static buildup in your clothing. Everything is staticky right now. Everything's staticky. You know, so the I've got dog static is tricks. buzzing, yeah. I'm buzzing, everyone's buzzing. I know, you get little like zzz. Zzz. Yeah, constantly. <laughs> okay, so I didn't realize that helped with so that. So that will help. The other trick, yeah. dryer sheets. Oh. So if you, although I have product in my hair, yeah. rub a dryer sheet in your hair yeah. before you toque. Yeah. When you detoque, you will get way less static coming off oh, your head. Oh, that's a good so tip. So sometimes I just put the dryer sheet in the top and yeah. leave it in there. You'll yeah. smell nice, they fresh. They smell really good. Right? Nice. Last one is safety pins. What do we do with those? So if you hide a safety pin mm -hmm. in your garment, it actually grounds you. Oh, really? Yeah, this is like high school oh, science. it's metal. It's metal. Yeah. So when you're walking around creating static, it's a little grounding. Oh, that's good. So you right? just stick it onto the You just the stick it somewhere hidden. Yeah, super easy. Oh my gosh, they wanted to clap for that, and I get it. <laughs> high school science. That's so good. <laughs> and all you need is a safety pin. Yeah. Excellent. All you need is a safety pin. So the other thing we're gonna do is beat scratchy sweaters. Okay. And beat scratchy toques is what drives me crazy, yes. right? I know you can kind of slow in, sew in sort of like Please pull their fleece or cover. something. We're not going to do that. Okay. We're going to give it a bath. Oh, is that going to make it less so scratchy? So you add a dollop of hair conditioner. Okay. You add a little bit of vinegar. Mm -hmm. Just a tiny bit. Which solves everything. Solves everything, right? Mix it up in lukewarm water. Yeah. And then you're just going to let it soak for a little while. Yeah. And then just do a proper hand wash out. So that's going to flat dry? Dish, yeah, you'll flat dry. So you actually, my trick, especially for these, is if you put it inside a salad spinner oh. <laughs> and spin really? your hat. Yeah. <laughs> so if you spin your hat, it will actually take the water out of your hat, right? So it'll okay. dry faster. All and right. then lay flat to dry. There's something about the conditioner, just like it will soften your hair, it will mm -hmm. soften, soften rough wool. Does, so that we can do that with our sweaters too. You can do that now. with your sweaters too. Hmm, that's good because yeah, I can't stand rinse. it. You get something, you try it on once, you think it's okay. That's an itchy and then fiber in the wool, day, yeah. It's itchy, oh, it's annoying. Good, Very annoying. Good hack. So next one, I know it's gotten really freezing, but yeah. we're going to embrace the cold. Are we? We are going to embrace, I swear <laughs> okay. we're going to, right? Let's so, embrace it. A little surprise for you. As <laughs> anyone who lives in a northern climate can tell you, if you run out of freezer space, we Use have giant your, snow banks everywhere. Use your backyard. Right? So there's things you can actually freeze that would be better for your clothing. Okay. Do you want to see? Yes. Dig in. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I'm oh, just going to make cold. some snowballs while I'm here. There you go. <laughs> oh. Oh. Let's see what here. we got. Oh, so what are we freezing? Can I open it up? Yes, you can. Okay. So, tights. Really? Tights are a great layering thing. So if you grab a pair of tights, soak them in water. Yeah. Stick them in a Ziploc. Okay. Freeze them. And what does that do? So it re-tightens the fibers, so you're less oh. likely to get runs quickly. Oh! So of course, take it out, lay it out, dry it out. Yes. Don't wear frozen tights. No. Oh. oh and yeah. snow banks are good for this. The other thing, and I think I left it in here, that I keep at home in mine. Yeah. There's too much snow in here, Tracy. There's a lot. So I know this is a big beauty oh, trend. Oh, yes. If you keep your roller in the freezer, yeah. it actually helps to de-puff. Oh, that's a great right? idea. So yeah, use your, use the, use your use snow. Use your snow bank. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need the fridge. So the last thing we're going to do tights. is save your soles, save your yes. shoes. Salt does a damage on our shoes, right? Look at this. This is I the I wore norm. these in this morning. Yeah. <laughs> and it wasn't that salty. But one of the tricks I do as a DIY is if you do a little vinegar, a little water, yeah. I add in a little lavender. Okay. It's prettier. Smells good. The vinegar will actually counteract the salt. So then when you wipe it, 
Because you know if you use water, you wipe salt stains, they basically it come right back. So if you do that, you can actually do a DIY version. They also now make handy wipes you can carry in your purse. Oh, that's great. That you can do between and just wipe it as you get to the office. Yeah, and this would be, you know what, if you've got an important meeting and you don't want to step in there with the yeah. salty boots, this is a great thing the to do. The other trick is as you're drying them, don't dry them on the heater. They're going to ruin your leather. Ah. Let them air dry on their own, fill yeah. them with paper. Very Perfect. nice. These are good tips. Thank you, Christian. You're welcome.